What is going on, guys? Welcome back. Commentary for Chantal has put up. Guess what? Ah, you got it. It's a mukbang. We start with a hamio. We see her in front of a large amount of food, citing she will eat, quote, half a donut for dessert. Keep that in mind. In front of her, lentil soup, a bread bowl, chicken McBoose. She says her and Sala exchanged meats, so she has some lamb meat as well as some of his pickle, which I imagine is the only time she gets his pickle. She pours sauce over everything and then offers incredible detail that you can only expect from someone who calls them a foodie, like the raisins are sweet, the peppers are hot. Her first bite consists of two chews. She then uses her flipper to peel the chicken skin off before eating it, eats a pickle, and then does a small dance on the floor. She moves on to the soup saying she, quote, doesn't feel like cooking, but eating this is okay because it's, quote, not junk. She offers that this is also her favorite food, which further makes it okay. So we're not cooking, we're not doing anything other than just ordering takeout and splitting it while Sala eats in the other room. She talks about, ironically, meeting Sala and how this is the meal that he would eat when they would go over video chat. She said that's her first memory of him and it's related to food, which is absolutely perfect. She says that she verified she hasn't ate this meal in quite a while, not before Thailand, because she went back and actually watched herself eating food. She wants to talk to us about a story, but then realizes it's actually just a TikTok that she saw. It's about a teacher who ordered Subway for lunch, but the lunch was wrong. Chantal eats feverishly while going through this story and citing that a food order not being proper shouldn't warrant a video being made, and that... She's a nobody to do this, and you'd be better off just calling the restaurant. But it turns out the employee actually responded with a TikTok of their own, showing the receipt and offering they didn't make the order wrong. Chantal then uses her flippers to tear apart the chicken in between massive spoonfuls. She questions why people even use social media to express issues. Meanwhile, it's her sole source of income. She says if it stresses you out to watch, simply turn it off, which would be great if she could do that to reaction channels, but she's never been able to do so, and she's also citing that she just watched a TikTok that stressed her out that she didn't not only turn off, but then went online to complain about. So I don't know how you could get more hypocritical than that. She says that they're going to have leftover rice. She's feeling better quickly, and this is going to allow them to make much more content on their couple's channel. The Everyday Miriam channel is still empty, by the way, and she wants to do some travel tips going forward for anyone that wants to leverage her experience to go to Thailand themselves. She says the bread bowl is going to be repurposed into croutons, because... What else goes good with wet, soggy bread than an oven? She continues to sing, pick at the bird, ramble on, saying she's not feeling social and it's impacting her transition over to TikTok. She continues to project that what she's doing now is just, quote, having dinner with her viewers and gives her an opportunity to show off these donuts. She nearly inhales the rice while talking about the weather, the camping they plan to do, and then obviously moves on to the coveted donuts. She offers she's just going to take a small piece, then takes half the donut. Prior in the video, she said she was only going to have half of one, but she continues to eat them despite it being stuck to her nose. She rips another donut in half and assumes it has Nutella inside. And she eats the crumbs off the table as they disintegrate in her flippers. She then moves on to the third and final donut, mocking it almost before eating it. She says, this is what makes her happy. She shows this is all she's capable of doing, and she continues to do things that put her channel in peril, and her health at risk. Love to know your thoughts on this. I will leave you with the top comments from the video from today and be back just like Chantal at a Dunkin' Donuts. Krispy Kreme Donuts, Starbucks, if they sell sweets and have something hot to drink, she'll be there, don't worry. Even if she can't drive, she'll have you deliver it. Soon as I can, with more content.